man. It's hot outside. I just want to stay home and eat some ice cream. Oh, man. Come on, put the lotion down, man. You're on the wrong hub. Man. What's up, guys? How you guys doing? Welcome back to the Fit Hub. I'm Richie Rico, and today we've got another review. So we've tried the Nick's ice cream. Today we're going to try out the Halo ice cream. We got six different flavors. We've got... What do we got here? We got some... Uh, Birthday cake, guys. Chocolate mocha chip. Ooh, caramel macchiato. Pistachio. Don't think I'm gonna like that. Did I get two caramel macchiatos? Guys, I realized I got two caramel mac. Ugh. Just realized I've got two caramel macchiatos or macchiatos, however you pronounce them. Don't know why I did that. So it looks like we're doing five flavors, guys. Caramel macchiato. Some B-roll for you. Ooh. Six grams of protein and only eight grams of sugar. Let's try it out. Before we get started, guys. We're gonna do this proper today. Got my golden spoon. Let's get started. I'm cracking the top off right in front of you guys so you know that it's brand new. It hasn't been tampered with. And also, you guys know that... I don't know. You guys just know that I'm opening it. Pop the top. Ooh. Look at that. Right to the rim. I'm gonna do this first bite up close so you guys can see how to do, do this properly. You wanna, you, know, you wanna get in there nice and smooth. Then you just wanna, mmm. We got some good flavor here. Got some good flavor here, guys. Caramel macchiato. Mmm. Good flavor. Doesn't feel like I got a bunch of gritty sugar sticking in my teeth either, so. Even though that does kind of sound good, gritty sugar sticking to my teeth right now. Yeah. But anyways, good flavor. Caramel macchiato. On point. I'm going to grade these later on today after I um, try these out. We'll do, a little, we'll do a little grading. You know, past videos I've realized after watching them. I just want to grate at the end. I want to grate during it. It's too much pressure. Let's just grate at the end. Chocolate mocha chip, guys. Three hundred and twenty calories, guys, per container. Eight grams of sugar. Seven grams of protein. Here's the rest of that nutritional data up close for you. Pop the lid right in front of you, guys so you know that it's new. I think the flavor's on point with what it should uh, be. You know, these are healthy alternative ice creams. So, you know, I'm kind of a little surprised sometimes. Usually the stuff tastes like crap. But it's, it's good, it's on point. If you're a chocolate uh, mocha chip kind of person, I think you might enjoy that. Man, that pre-workout got me freaking hot, man. Whew. I'm trying to shoot this video before I go to the gym. I don't know if I'm gonna take pre-workout before a video again. Whew. Face is itching and hot. Wow. Woo! Alright. Pistachio! Can I say that? Anyways, 200 calories in a serving. I mean, sorry, 200 calories in this whole pint, in this whole container. Six grams of protein. Seven grams of sugar, guys. B-roll. Got the B-roll ready, guys? Here comes the B-roll. Nutritional data. You guys getting that? Look at those effects. Oh.
I think I had pistachio maybe like once in my lifetime. But um, I think pistachio isn't supposed to taste like a pistachio. I don't know if my taste buds are off or something from this pre-workout I drank, but it tastes kind of like banana or something in there. I don't know what that is, but um, uh, I don't know. I don't think I like pistachio. I just think that's what that is. I, I mean, I'm probably just wrong right now. I think I'm pretty sure that that's pistachio. I don't know why I'm getting a hint of banana. Really weird. Meh. I don't really like it. I don't like it. I don't like the pistachio, guys. It's it's not for me. I think maybe, I guess, the... No, I'm not... It, something's not right with the pistachio, guys. It tastes like banana. It tastes like banana. I don't know what that is. Down to the final two. We got birth cake. Birth cake? Birthday cake. Cookies and cream. Which one do we want to do? Which one do I want to do? I like cookies and cream better. So I'm going to save that one for last. Birthday cake is up next. Six grams of protein. Eight grams of sugar. So sweaty looking. I think they gotta be more specific when they say birthday cake. You know, it's like, it's birthday cake. But there's a lot of different types of birthday cakes, you know? Like, is this, this marble birthday cake? Technically, I guess it's an ice cream cake. I guess that makes sense. Let's get a summertime scoop's worth, right? It's hot out today. Summertime scoop worth, ready? Hey, hey! Hey, stop moving the backdrop. Some bad cat right here, guys. This is Hendrix, the world's baddest kitten. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. First player, man, cat, no? A cat so bad. That's the world's baddest kitten right there. I don't know if any of you guys got a kitten right now, but as soon as it hits 5 a.m., this cat is attacking your face, your feet. He's jumping on the headboard. He's freaking scratching the hell out of you. I got scratches all over my hands. A kitten's bad, man. Anyways, birthday cake is good. I feel like it's got like, oh, it's got sprinkles in it, guys. I know I sound excited for that. Can't go wrong with birthday cake. Highly recommend the birthday cake. Finally, we got the cookies and cream. This is usually my favorite, so high expectations for this one. I've had some good cookies and cream in my past. About to find out. Halo Top. This is going to make and break you guys right here, I'm telling you. My little, my little, in, 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 how do you say that word? What's that word for when you're really small? You haven't blown up yet? You haven't gotten big yet? What am I talking about? My little, in, hey Google. What's the word for small, not known? Well, that ain't gonna help me. Anyways, this better be good. That was really cool. I'm choked on ice cream. My death video of me choking on ice cream. The vanilla tastes a little bit weird in this one. I'm a boring kind of guy when it comes to ice cream. I really like vanilla. It's my favorite ice cream. And this vanilla tastes a little weird, to be honest. It's like, um... I don't know, I think it could be better. It's not bad. I just feel like it could be a little bit better. It's got pieces of like cookie in here. I want to assume it's Oreo. It doesn't taste exactly like vanilla. I don't know. I was really looking forward to the cookies and cream. It's good, but it's just, uh, the vanilla is just a little bit weird. But it's still, it's, you know, hey, it's supposed to be healthy ice cream. So I mean, it's not going to be perfect. It's not going to be like the real stuff. But, it is what it is, guys. You want to eat good. You want to eat healthy at the same time. You know, you got you to gotta take losses somewhere. So, for me, it's on the cookies and cream, unfortunately. 
I think that these are. Uh, I think they're man. I kind I think I tried one of these in the past. I don't remember what flavor it was, and uh, I didn't like it at all. I don't remember what flavor it was. I think it was like a year ago or so. Like I've never. I'm not really too big on ice cream that much, but lately I've just been having these sugar cravings since I've gotten back from vacation. So I'm trying out a lot of these healthy snacks, you know, and uh, yeah, I, I, I never really got too much into the ice cream, the healthy ice cream, but uh, or the healthier ice cream. But um, I, like I said, I did try out one of these ice creams in the past and I didn't like it. And then recently I just tried out the next ice cream and I thought it was really good. I thought it was really good for a healthy ice cream, you know, not having uh, much sugar in it, and it's, uh, you know, sugar just makes ice cream, it makes it what it is, it makes it, you know, it gives it the flavor, you know, honestly, things without sugar that usually have sugar typically suck when they don't, so, um, like I was saying though, the NYX ice cream surprised me, I thought it was very good, and now I just tried these, and to be honest, um, these Halo Tops, I think are better, I think they're honestly better, um, they're a little more expensive, I forgot exactly what I paid for these. Let me let me check my receipt real fast. There's my receipt, all crinkled up. Okay, so these aren't actually, I don't think any different than the next ice cream price wise. I think I paid $5.19 and I got these at Stop and Shop, which we all know is way more expensive than like, if you go to Walmart or something like that. So, um, stop messing with my backdrop. Ah, that cat, messed that cat up, man. You know, this is gonna be one of the films right then they say, you know, Instead of saying no animals was hurt, there's gonna be some animals getting hurt, man. This cat's gonna get his treats taken away. That's gonna hurt him. So, um, not a bad price. Good flavor. A little bit better than the next ice cream. A little bit better than the next ice cream. Um, I highly recommend it. You guys wanna get out there and get yourself some ice cream. Stop by your local whatever store you got. Walmart, Stop and Shop. Seems like those are the places to have it. Um, good stuff. I really enjoyed it. Got some more ice cream to add to the fridge, to the freezer. But um, that's it guys, I'll see you guys again soon. I hope you liked my video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And you know, it really helps out you guys, you know, if you guys do that for me because like, you know, if I, if I don't make it doing this, you know, I don't, I don't wanna have to go do the fans only. I mean, I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't want you guys to have to come see me on the fans only. So. You know, please like, comment, subscribe. I see you guys watching the videos, but you gotta subscribe to the channel. Cause I'm telling you, you're gonna see me in your feed with the fans only. You don't want that. You don't want that, trust me. You know what I'm saying?